Welcome to the Denver Coliseum and the National Western Stock Show. If you're into farming, if you're into rodeos, if you're into livestock, this is the place to be, especially if you're a cowboy or a cow gal. But let's face it, this is a fast lane truck and we're into trucks and trailers. And that is coming up next on the fast lane truck from the Denver National Western Stock Show. Check this out guys, Miss Rodeo Colorado 2014. This trailer will go to Miss Colorado 2014 and I've got a real treat for you. She's in there right now waiting to talk to you. So let's open it up. Oh, sorry, it's not Miss Colorado, but we have Mr. Truck and of course, Nathan. You guys really are gonna disappoint well, these guys. Here. She was here, she was here just recently. Yeah, right. Inside the show now with surprise Nathan Nathan and of course mr. truck Kent and we're here at the Chevy booth and we're gonna find out who the true truck guy is so Kent given all these fine Chevy products which would you choose I gotta go with the newest the 2015 heavy-duty 2500 Chevy Silverado and this is from a man who drives a heavy-duty truck so that makes sense you know for me I'm really impressed by that vehicle right there the Silverado, the new Silverado. It drives like a dream. It's a lot of fun, and that will be my choice. And of course, Nathan, what's your choice? Follow me. Let me show you. It's just right here. Come on. The Chevy Camaro truck. <laughs> Nathan, that's an SS. It's not a truck. I'm okay with that. <laughs> You know, Nathan, show jumping is one of the most beautiful equestrian sports, nay, art forms that you can watch. I mean, look at the majesty, look at the power of that animal. It is just, it is just poetry in motion. Look at the tight pants. This looks like a cow spa to me. What are you guys doing here? Oh, uh, we're showing cattle. Yeah? Yep. Um, tomorrow, the bull, he, oh, he laid down. He showed yesterday, and the two heifers will show tomorrow. So we basically will wash them and dry them in the morning. And then Justin, he will also, he's going to trim up the heifers for their show tomorrow. So what are the judges looking for? I mean, I saw you vacuuming one of the cows. Uh, well, <laughs> we're actually blow drying them, basically, is okay. what that is. That's a hot air blower. Um, like a spa. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. pretty similar. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, guys. Now that is a truck. That is not a cowboy truck. That is a cowman truck. A Ram 5500, Kent. This is the cat's meow. It's as big as it gets. Class 5 truck. Cab and chassis seat channel, just like a Peterbilt. And the frame, just like a Peterbilt, 50,000 PSI. The strength of this frame. Well, wait, wait, wait. Isn't the new Ford F-150, the 2015 model, 70,000 pounds? Yeah. Oh, so it's, why? Its frame is 70,000 pounds PSI on the new Ford? Yes, the 150 is like a super frame. Wow, that is crazy, dude. That's overkill. interiors in-house. It's 11 foot short wall. It's eight wide. It's got a six foot slide out on it. Um, it's got the Nadi all their cabinets. So solid wood cabinets. We're proud of that. We have our own cabinet shop there. We do everything in-house. Um, it's nice. I mean, you, you know, if you're, if you're hauling yeah. horses, man, this is a nice way yeah, to do it. Yeah, it's got everything. TVs, heater, 
so, AC. So is this the kind of trailer that like a rodeo person would have? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, we got several people that pull these, you know, they're going full time. Luke Branquino, Strand Smith, Tyson Durfee, and you know, many others that they live in these trailers pretty yeah. much all year long. It has everything you need, it's just house on wheels. In the rear of Logan Coach trailer, they have what's called a whiz proof floor. It has slats made out of aluminum and it's actually coated with a, with a vortex coating. And it's slanted at an angle so that the water runs out of it and it can't splash back in there. This way your horses can do their job like you see the model horse there doing. And then it's out of the trailer so instead of rotting your floor it goes right through it. it makes it all green and back to nature. And your floor stays dry and you don't have to do all that heavy duty cleaning. Alright, horses don't pee standing up. They don't? No, that's what that picture is. Oh, <laughs> well some horses train very heavily are. <laughs> Now we were going to get Nathan up on either the Clydesdale horse or the bull, but there was like a line of 10 year olds and so we just felt that it was not fair to deprive them of the experience of sitting on a Clydesdale because we don't need a Clydesdale on a Clydesdale, do we Nathan? No we don't. No, so instead we're over here at the, what the heck is this thing doing to our back? It's doing wonderful things to mine. <laughs> at the massaging chair back <laughs> arena. Highly recommended. When I like to come here, I look at all the trucks. They come here from everywhere, from Texas, from Dakota, from Washington. And they're most of one ton dualies pulling these 40 foot stock traders, hauling show cattle, hauling horses, hauling, you know, pigs, sheep, everything comes to National Western. And the interesting part is what these trucks are like. How they got to drive heavy weights, 20,000, 30,000 pounds, all across the country. And they have to keep them running. And it's nice talking to them. They can tell you all the stories of where they broke down, what happened, where their last tire blew out. These are the guys that really put the miles on the trucks and really abuse the trucks. It's a great to find out how they're holding up out here. Hey guys, let's try it one more time. Now Nathan, there's no SS pickup. Just let's be very clear about Not that. Not anymore. So let's find out who the true truck guy is here. We've got three trucks. We're in front of the Dodge display. Kent, which would you pick? Well, of course it's got to be the Ram 3500 Dually with a Mega Cab. That is a big pickup, but I'm going to go with the 2500 over my left shoulder because it's four-wheel drive and it's way cool. And Nathan, what's your choice? Follow me. Come on. Come here. So pass the little guy right here. Come here. Black Hemi. Once you go black, you never go back. <laughs> The National Western Stock Show runs through January 26th. And if you want to come down here and see America at its best, have a little bit of barbecue, maybe check out a truck and trailer or two, this is a great place to be. As always, this is Roman reporting for the Fast Lane Truck. About to grab myself some more barbecue. See you next time.